Hello everyone. I hope you're enjoying the weather. It's so nice and lovely. Uh, this is a kind of a general fear thing now that I know is affecting uh, practically every one of us. And um, the government doing everything to relieve every one of us, to help, to make uh, life bearable for every one of us. I is a kind of general feel like 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 I said earlier. In terms of the fact that um, despite the effort of the government trying to relieve everyone and everything, we know also that the cost of living practically everywhere, not in UK alone, everywhere, the cost of living has really skyrocketed. For example which is part of the reason why I'm doing this video. For example, um, my council tax used to be like uh, £33 every month. And as usual, last month I decided to pay £50 of my total annual um, amount. And um, this month also I paid another £50. Then the letter came in today which is a statement of my annual council tax and is like over 500, uh, over 800 pounds and the normal 33 pounds monthly payment skyrocket to around 90 something pounds and I have to make first payment of 96 pounds. Unknown to me that the price has gone off. I paid, like I said earlier, 50 pounds last month and 50 pounds this month. And I've been making effort to contact them anyway so that uh, we'll be able to get clarification to the fact that, well, the two payments had up to like 100 pounds uh, because I don't want a situation where I'll get in trouble or problem with any of you know when it comes to your bills and everything i try as much as possible to shy away from you know getting into trouble with any one of those because at the end of the day you end up like paying way 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 more than the original amount and i was wondering from 33 pounds how can my council tax go up as high as 90 Three, was it 93 or 90, 90, 90 something pounds? Putting into consideration the cost of living, the way things are really skyrocketing, and uh, getting, you know, that the government have to step in to help people in order for, you, you know, for every one of us to be able to have, uh, you know, to balance the equation for everyone to be able to, you know, to ease off the pressure on, you know, that is on people because of the standard of living that has gone up. And I was, it's not even 60 something, it's like 90 something pounds. I don't know. I don't get it. Almost 100 pounds to be paid every month. And I was cracking my brain that how will I be able to afford to pay that coffee with other bills? And considering the fact that you won't want to get any trouble with, you know, going to car, bleed this and blah, 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 blah. If any one of you has been affected by this, please put your message under the comment. I would like to hear from other people that has been affected by this. And uh, in terms of general affairs also, recently I also had issue with... You know when I, I when you when I, I, I bought something online and I was expecting it the next day and it never arrived and I have to contact the people I bought it from and they were like and I'll check online my account and it says that it's been delivered to one of the people in the residence and I was like nobody came to my address to deliver anything. I was home that day to row with my kids and we did not get anything. And the, the company, thank God for them, they have to step in and say, we will contact the seller. I wrote the sellers myself as well. And I have to contact the company again. And they say, you know what? We'll, get, we'll give you a refund because one way or the other, the item never arrived. 
and how it makes me become weary of you know buying stuff online because i was saying to one of my kids that you need this but we can only get it online if we buy it online what's the what's the assurance that we will receive our order and uh, because it's quite expensive to get in what it needed due to its size and everything and i was like I wouldn't want to throw money down the drainage again and I don't want to go through the trouble of oh we didn't receive our delivery this and that so I became really weary okay. about you know doing things online because I was like if I go online to get to this to do this purchase will I receive my item so security of your item also is a big question now when you say when you make a purchase and you're not sure if you get your item or not but the good thing is that the company that you make your purchase with you are not taking it lightly in terms of that they, they the moment you contact them they swing into action to make sure that either you get your item or they refund the money to you and thanks to amazon for that and i know that other companies are also doing the same thing so I don't know what to say about this and uh, you know a whole lot a whole lot is going on generally in the society and is affecting people's life and you know you wonder are they making life easier for people or they're making life difficult for people you wonder what exactly is happening and I was like, is it only myself? Am I the only one? But definitely I know that I'm not the only one. I know that other people might be having the same problem. Like I mentioned, the council tax also that skyrocketed from £33 to £93 or so pounds. And I was, what was going on? Where are we going to? If we get support one way or the other, if the, if the government supports you and you end up, giving the money out because everything skyrocket and i don't know i don't know i don't know but whatever your opinion is about this please kindly leave your comment and this does not mean that we are i personally does not mean that i'm not appreciative of what the government are doing they're doing a wonderful job walking around the clock to make sure that you know life is easy for every one of us so kudos to them kudos to all the uh, heroes that are walking around the clock i uh, really really appreciate this but yeah whatever you think about this just put your comment down on the below on the on the channel below the video and let me know your thought and if you have your own personal experience also that you want to share because apart from the fact that i uh, uh, that i had experience the experience i had with my order i had another experience with uh, my security uh, the security company that covers my house as well and i was like I've not received my item, but in the, in that in their case, I I'm like okay, maybe the item delayed, so which is understandable. But let me know, let me let me know your comment, and share your experience also, and I will see you again soon. So you take care now. Have a lovely day. Enjoy the weather. Remain blessed. Love you all. God bless you all. Bye bye bye.